Yeah, what's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Endless Uploads. For today's show, we take a look at some of the most well, first crazy Karen has an epic meltdown after she caused an accident. Yeah, this is some typical Karen behavior, guys. Let's check it out. I mean you have a whole parking lot to park your vehicle, so I didn't want to park. I was trying to get out. Yeah, I know, so you could get out and no, nobody needs to run your mouth. Is your car all right or not? Uh lose the attitude. No, it's not. Oh, where's, where's the damage? Uh, right here. Oh, it's a little dirt. Ah, uh, it's not dirt. Thank you. Oh, uh, well, I didn't hit the side. Do you have insurance and your driver's you? license? Will you wait? I'll call, I'll go ahead and call Palm Bay PD. You go I'm, ahead. I'm videoing You're everything. You're ignorant. I'm ignorant. There's a little. You have an entire parking lot. You backed into my vehicle. I asked you to park. And as I'm looking at the damage of my car, you there about ran no me damage. over. There's some dirt. There's cameras everywhere. Well, Sorry. Well, oh, well, good for you. You're such a smart-ass, mouthy bitch. Uh, as we stand in a church parking lot? Well, you're the one that's... I just touched it. There is I'm walking from here watching my vehicle move forward as you back oh, into it. I didn't... Oh, come on, lady. I Do you have insurance? I'm not going to argue with you. Stop. He was telling you. you. As well, I'm well, over there. Well, right such an ass. I'm an ass because you ran into my vehicle. Do you I'm have active. Do you have car insurance and your driver's no, license? No, you're not getting it. Okay. Uh, so in our next clip, this trans woman was just trying to enjoy dinner at this restaurant, and this crazy Karen decided to harass her for no reason. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. You are now watching endless uploads. <laughs> Are you a turf? Well, I'm a turf. Wow. Would you like me to move somewhere else? I guess. No, actually. You should you should tell me about being a turf. You're this. a boy, right? Who's fault with me? Because honestly, I did. I did hard. I'd like to see you try. Well, then don't judge me for being a turf. I get to be who I want to be. You get to be who you want to be. Right? If that's what you want. To be who you want to be, then I get to be who I want to be. Which is? I'm not a witch. You're not a witch. You know what? Take your stupid dog, eat your fucking food, and get the fuck out of my life, okay? This is a first. Because otherwise they have to label you a white racist. I see. For a 70-year-old minority woman, you're a racist. You want your rights? I want mine too. Excuse me. Could you grab the manager, please? I am so terribly sorry. I'll never be escalating. I'm not trying to get another patient. I do apologize. I apologize about that treatment. Karen felt like these McDonald's employees were taking way too long with his order, so he decided to take matters into his own hands. Let's check it out. Here you go. I did it myself. I got my twin nugs. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm tired of waiting. <laughs> I got to get I'll have to come back behind the counter and McDonald's. You got what? You got what? To what? You got what? To what? You got what? To what? What you got? I don't know the address, man. What you got? 29. Yeah, I got <laughs> Our next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown at McDonald's all because he felt like his coffee was lukewarm. Yeah, you can't make this up, guys. Let's check it out. <laughs> Give me your manager's phone number or give me my money back. You don't want to. It's okay. I'll take pictures of all you. I'll come back and when she's working and I'll explain to the next. So we got an easy choice. You give me your phone number to the manager or you have a problem when we come back tomorrow. 
<laughs> so our next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown at Popeyes and things got ugly really quick. Let's check it out. I was just trying to do his job when he comes across this crazy caring couple who makes his life extremely difficult. Let's check it out. Okay, so You're call, done. call the cop. You know, I'm actually here to work on the pool so there's no mosquitoes for you guys. No, you, you know that, right? You know that, right? That's not going to dry. It's toxic sludge. It's toxic. It's been there two years. I'm here to treat the pool so you guys have no mosquitoes. You realize that, right? Oh, I realize what's been going on. I've been living Hey, it don't matter. I'm jumping to the, to the house backyard. I'm not going to touch your property. Just go to your house. See, see, see. I want to report right now. Ma'am, I don't know who they are. I, I don't work for I them. Okay, I don't know. You Call them. Primo. Uh, so this next woman goes toe to toe with her crazy Karen landlord, and it looks like things were starting to get heated. Let's shake it up. Making medical diagnosis when you're not even a doctor or even a trained specialist to make any type of diagnosis. Yeah, because you know that. Because you know that. Yeah, you do. You know that. Yeah. Where's your certificate? Oh, yeah, because remember, okay. I moved everything in okay. in one room, okay. and so things are in packages, oh, things are in yeah, boxes. Okay. Okay. But I don't need to show okay. you anything. Yeah. 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 You're, not, you're not a doctor. You're, you're not right, a I'm not a doctor. And also, you're, I'm not asking. Why do you keep coming towards? Me. Oh my God, look I'm at those things. Alright, so these next group of women confront this guy for taking secret photos of them on Halloween. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments what y'all think about this situation right here. Let's check it out. Wait, why are you taking videos though? Because you're just standing there doing your thing. And really? So you think I'm creepy yeah, and go. you claim that I'm creepy? Yeah. Creepy. Here, look at here's my face. Here's my face. Right there. Don't you dare. Do not touch me because everything is on video and I swear to God I will call the cops and I will smack you. Oh my God. I'll call 911. We're done. We're done. Get the out of here. You get the out of here. You pervert. Let's go. I bet I'm a pervert. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Pervert. Wow. Fucking perv. That is fucking creepy. And you better watch out for your fucking car, dude. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Uh, so these next group of women are only fans, models, and they get into a very heated confrontation with the owner of this restaurant after they were refused service because the owner felt like they were dressed inappropriately. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments what y'all think about this situation right here. Let's check it out. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Mais c'est vous qui écrivez les règles Je comprends pas. Bah oui, c'est moi. C'est écrit. Non, mais c'est écrit où que dans Paris, on n'a pas le droit. Bah ouais. Pas ce matin. Bah là, c'est la discrimination. On n'a pas le droit de faire ça. Appelle la police. Bon, appelle la police. Allez, je vais vous toucher. Ne touche pas, par contre. Ne touche pas. Donc, la next crazy Karen a un epic meltdown à ce subway. Damn, it's been crazy 2022 pour ces employés, man. Let's check it out. No. Should I throw something at her? You <laughs> so this next woman caught this DoorDash delivery driver getting a little snack for herself before delivering the food. Yeah, this is some crazy stuff, guys. Let's check it out. So y'all already know breakups can be hard and some exes are more crazier than others and this next woman proves exactly why. So this next woman decided to show up to her ex-boyfriend's wedding uninvited to ruin the day. Yeah, this woman definitely has a lot of issues, y'all. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments what would you do if you was in this situation. Let's check it out. Because Karen completely loses her shit at 7 Eleven. Let's check it out. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You gonna get a sparkling? Dude, tell her to throw me a Perrier. <laughs> So I don't know if you guys ever been to Waffle House before, but one thing I can say about those employees, they do not f around when it comes to crazy Karens. Let's check it out. Then what the f Because I just said what the f I just said. Bye bye, white girl. Listen to a heated confrontation with this crazy Karen at this gym. Let's check it out. Anybody else? I think Pay attention, it's on me. Oh, there's the boy I am. Well, I have permission. 
Oh no, no, of course I got it. I, uh, I jumped two days ago and didn't say it's fine. Please, last thing I want is your face on the camera. You. Okay? Jesus. I'm coming with you. Okay. Uh -huh. You have something you want to buy? Yeah. Okay, then let's go down here. Uh -huh. Yeah, right down here. <laughs> So these next two guys get into a very heated confrontation, and these guys ugly. You're putting really your on the fucking door. Let's check it. The breath that you take is a gift of God's mercy. You don't deserve the next next breath that you take. Go make that public while you stand here. Karen gets arrested at this airport after she was told that her seat needs to be changed. So Karen was sitting in this aisle seat, and after she was told that her seat was going to be changed, that's when she completely lost her sh**. So let's check out the full video and see how it all went down. Let's check it out. Yeah, this is on you. No, I did not cause a disturbance. They fucking told me I'm an idol. All right, All right, so our next crazy entitled Karens decided to walk into strangers' homes just to stop their holiday parties, all because they felt like they were making too much noise. Yeah, you cannot make this shit up, guys. Let's check it out. Huh, a Karen stormed into our Christmas party. Get the penguin. Can I ask you guys about 10 after 11? You need to, you're not, this is not your party. Alright, so this next guy gets into a heated confrontation with this Karen at this comedy club for a very odd reason. Let's check it out. Reason is not the word you want to say when you're about. No, no, don't record. I just want to make sure we're in 2021. Caucasian is not a good word to say. I'm not speaking for half of the people in here, but I'm mm. just saying, just don't, don't say that. Don't say Caucasian. No. Got it. Don't. Caucasian is the best. This is the most on brand 2021 sh ever, bro. Literally, I just got told a word I can't. This is hilarious, my nigga. This is cool as shit. Stupid white people. That's it. That's the brand name. I'm not racist at all. I'm not saying you're racist. I hear that. But just, just so we're clear, right? And this is just for my legal protection come to a white bar saying Caucasian. Caucasian is a slur in 2021. Oh, we cannot is. say that. It is. <laughs> it is. I love stand-up comedy so fucking much. You cannot I mean, have this shit anywhere though, else. You, you guys have been great. You don't know what you're getting into. Yikes. Oh, that sounds like I might get hung, so I'm gonna roll out. You guys have a nice day. <laughs> Bye. Nice to meet y'all. Nice to meet y'all. Uh, was the one oh hell no, I don't play. So our next crazy Karen gets into a heated conversation with damn near everyone at this parking lot. Let's check it out. I just f***ing said I am. Walk away. Walk the fire lane. None of you are going to do shit. F***ing move. You're not going to do a goddamn thing. I'll f***ing crush all of you. Get the f*** out of here. Shut up. Hey, why don't you calm down? Oh, you want to? Cool. Get the f*** out of here. 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 Get the f***
I can get violent with you because you're a guy. You know how to fuck around, too. Come on neighbor parking neighbor drama decided she's going to move her car over to make it difficult for me to get out of my vehicle you'll see the daughter take the purse from the mother she gets in her car she backs up and moves the car over my husband's car is to the right it's a black car and I always back into my parking spot um, so when I came home right after she did this, you'll see me pull in in the background and stop at the mailbox to the left. When I get home and back in, it's difficult for me to open my vehicle um, and get out. I do have a handicap placard. to have this thing with my hip where I have to twist, turn, and push my door open and then get out. But when I pulled in and opened my door backwards, I couldn't open my car door, so I had to park the other direction. And then you'll see a picture here in a second. Here it is. Karen has an epic meltdown at this airport after getting into a heated confrontation with another guy. Let's check it out. Sleep, please. I'm on this shit, boy. I you. We advise. Okay. Uh, so these next group of guys get into a very heated confrontation with this crazy Karen after she decided to jump inside their conversation. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments how would you handle this situation right here. Let's check it out. But I don't interrupt. But right. But no one, no one invited you into my conversation. But no one invited you. You started because you jumped in my conversation. You because you're immature. Okay, but you jumped in my conversation. No one invited you. It doesn't matter. Oh, it only because it doesn't matter to you. You freak out because you're immature. Wait, I freaked out? Adults were conversation. <laughs> no, it wasn't this. It was this. And you jumped in. You immediately called games, even though we're trying to talk about like... But no one said, hey, ma'am, yeah. could you jump in our conversation? It doesn't matter. Don't I know, because you didn't like what you matter. heard. You don't have to be about it. But no one said, hey, could you jump in? You're Can I get so a to-go box, line. please? You're out of line. Yeah. You're you so out of line. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. No one said, yeah. hey, come on in our conversation. You just decided to do it. And that's the problem with you out here, is you feel like you have the right to jump in on our conversation. Okay. No one mind your business. Mind so your business. You could have said No, I couldn't don't have. Be in my conversation, but you have to call names. I would have liked it. Can I ask you a question? What gave you the right to jump? Uh, so our next crazy Karen gets called out and confronted for dragging her dog around his store. Let's check it out. Tina Karen letting her dog get hurt by shopping carts. This lady here. The poor puppy is getting ran over, already got ran over twice, and she's just dragging the puppy around. I told her to pick him up. Everybody's telling her to pick up the poor puppy, and this stupid bitch is just dragging him everywhere. No, we should go. Wait, he forgot to take his picture. Get this crazy lady out of here. Poor puppy. And she's still dragging the poor puppy where it's full of cards. That is so. That is so. I really think that this wasn't really clearly good in the head because it's more than obvious. But I'm just so mad because the poor dog got ran over twice, bro. Two times by two different cards and this bitch was still not picking up the fucking poor dog like oh and i can't do 
because you know i can't just go and take her dog away uh, so this next woman gets into a very weird confrontation with this crazy karen all because karen thought she worked for the store let's check it out that's all i said yeah, but you don't work here. You shouldn't even be attacking me. You're attacking me. You don't even work here. I'm not attacking you. Is there a reason why? First of all, you told me to remove my cart. Get my cart out the way because so they can move. Correct. You do not work here. So why are you attacking me? I'm not attacking you. I'm just yes, here waiting you are. for the things to be here, ma'am. Yeah, but you attacking me. I'm not attacking you. Yes, you are. Not at all. Act like you don't see me. Act as if you don't see me. You are going to go into the employees only entrance when you're not an employee. Yeah, but and I'm talking to the security here. guard and the managers involved because y'all complaining. So why are you attacking me? I'm not attacking you, ma'am. Don't say a word to me. Don't say a word to me. Okay. I promise. Don't say a word to me. Do not say a word to me. You were yeah. trying to go in the employee only entrance when you are. Yeah, where did it say employee only? It says the employee. Yeah, but you do not right work now. here. Are you a security guard? You getting paid for this? I'm not an employee, and neither are you. So why are we going to go to the employee only? I'm entrance? talking to an employee. I'm, I, I just spoke to an employee. That's perfect. So fine, why are you, you attacking me? I'm Would you attacking stop you. attacking me? I'm not. You are harassing me. Not at all. If you want to talk further, we can go out and have a one-on-one -on -one talk. Stop harassing me. You are harassing me. First of all, you told me to remove my cart, take my cart out the way. Now I'm talking to the security guard and you are harassing me. You being a Karen. Miss Karen. Stop harassing me. And I'm really trying to be nice. Do not harass me. I'm trying to be real nice. Trust me. So this next guy was walking around Walmart with his service dog and he seen another family who had a dog at Walmart and decided to call them out all because Walmart's policy states that you cannot have pets inside the building and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video. You guys make sure to let me know in the comments who do you feel like is right or wrong in this crazy situation. Let's check it out. It's so annoying the way she said that though. She was like... <clears throat> She literally said, we know the rules. I said, no pets are allowed in here. And she's like, we know the rules. I was like, bitch. Let's see if we see him over here. Sorry. Are you fine? That's them. Okay. Sorry. You can't have that thing in here. Well, they have to send it to us, police Walmart. Smart butt. I'm a minor Do you see how people act here? Here, get a good picture. Yeah. Don't come close. Cheese. Bitch. Cheese. Go away. Yeah, you're gonna get out. What? Holy sh! Boy, you better get your butt on out the door. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. No, because I'm not doing anything. I'm not gonna be like that. Get the skin cut. Let's get the skin cut. Go on now. Come on, I'm gonna pick you up. Go on now. Boy, you almost had to. I'm on you. You better get your ass on out here now. You better. You better get your ass on that. Fat ass son of a Get the away from me. You better get the away from me. You nasty son of a bitch. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments what y'all think about this situation right here. I'm gonna listen to a very heated confrontation with this crazy Karen, and she made sure to troll him as much as she could. Let's check it out. Here we go. Look at this guy. Well, come on, you mouthy. Look at you. you. Look at equal rights. Look at equal rights. Look at you, you little bitch. Well, you're a, 
I'm a Republican. Well, you probably a Democrat. You Are you an idiot? You had an abortion. My brother. Your mother. My mother. Your I thought you were a Republican. I thought you were a Republican. You don't believe in abortion. Try again, bud. You skank. Oh, you. Oh, I'm so. I'm so mad. I'm gonna hit you. What the f are you talking about? You're twice my size. You dumb. You got is this my camera? Is this my video? Daddy, stop it, Daddy. Daddy. Oh, I love your f shoes. What are those? What are those? Uh, so our next place, Karen has an epic meltdown while waiting in line at Dunkin' Donuts. Let's jump right into it. Uh, so this next woman gets into a very weird confrontation with this crazy Karen, all because Karen did not like the fact that she was parking in this spot. Yeah, you can't make this up, guys. Let's check it out. Telling me you're a volunteer firefighter. This is a parking spot. I don't care what you have to say. If you have a problem going to Walgreens, I was just eating the the snacks that I bought from there. And I'm sitting here, and that is, I am not in the way of the fire hydrant. It's a parking spot. I'm not getting upset. I don't know why you're harassing me. This is a parking spot. Don't you think they would block it off if it wasn't blocking a fire hydrant? You might want to get some help. You might want to go to the doctor and check yourself. Okay, lady, I'm sorry. This is a parking spot. Uh, so our next crazy Karen completely loses her sh after this guy cut her off while driving. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments what y'all think about this whole crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. She just hit my car. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Why are you so mad? 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 Why are you threatening me? I'm just trying to get to work. I'm just trying to get to work. Uh, so this next guy goes toe to toe with this crazy Karen at McDonald's. Damn, there's been a lot of action at McDonald's lately. Let's check it out. <laughs> you know, I'm not pop bro. And I'm not playing, bro. Get the f shit away. Get that f away from me, bro. <laughs> like what? Get that f off me, this bro. This is Karen, bro. I've never experienced one. He videotaped me. I don't even know what to do. That's what I'm saying. You're at McDonald's. But still, no, you can't. You have to get a percent. Oh, God. It's okay. I want to be a, My husband will beat the f out of you. Oh, tell him to. Karen, bro, I never experienced a Karen. I'm like, I'll go viral. Uh, so this next woman goes toe to toe with the manager of Dunkin' Donuts after she won a specific order. But things did not go her way. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments who do you feel like is the real Karen in this whole situation. Let's check it out. She's lactose intolerant. Cause I'm lactose intolerant. Can you please get out of my line? Thank you. Why? Because I said so. Get out of my line. No, I just ordered. Okay, I, and I deleted your order. I'm not making. Why are you can denying you my, my line, service please? right now? Because I am the manager, and I said I'm not giving you any service. Can you please get out of my line? Okay, and you're the manager. Oh, yes, I am. Get out of my line, or I will trespass you. Get out of my line. Wait, can I just ask? Can I just ask? Can, just ask just my line. can we just get a reason why? Because I told you the reason why. Now get out of my line. Thank you. Because I forgot that I was okay. Get out of I had my no line now. My dairy. Get out of my line now. Okay. Holy fuck. 
Uh, so this next crazy Karen decided to harass this woman who was just trying to do her job and deliver her packages and got exactly what she deserves. Let's I was trying to deliver a package when I encountered a wild Karen. If you walk up to me, I'll push it. Go ahead. What are you doing? You're parking in a handicap no, shut spot. Up. I'm just delivering packages. No, no, you are parked uh, bro, in a move. I don't have to. You're on my property bro, now. Come on. People get into a very heated confrontation with these airline employees all because they felt like they were trying to overcharge them for an oversized bag. You already know some of these airlines try to overcharge you and have all these hidden fees, so they felt like that's what was going on. They was not having it, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments who do you feel like is the real Karen in this whole situation. Let's check it out. I've flown four times this year already. Yes, and we do understand that not all allegiant sites. Can you tell me what the specs are, please? And then what, what makes this an oversized bag? You're be because of the, the way size. you see it. Because of the size. No, you need What's the size? size? What makes this an oversized bag? The, the size. That's all I have to tell we you. The, is the size. Well, we need the, the size. Like, we need yeah. specifications. You can't so just when we fly with the legion, you can't just you can't eyeball it. Has it. To have their rules. Correct. It's an oversized bag. Where does it say that? Okay, I, I'm not speaking of this anymore. If I, you ask me again, you will not fly today. End of story. This is unbelievable. And you, you will not provide your information? No, sir. Your name? I do not have to. Okay. You, you don't? Oh, okay. And you can record me. I am. We have yes. I, I know this is so this next woman calls out these crazy Karens for using racial slurs at this pool. Let's check it out. Well, I kind of want to know what it is that you said. Nothing. Nothing. Why are you taking it back? I'm not taking nothing back. Then why aren't you saying it? That was so disrespectful and racist. Ignore. Ignore. She's the one that told us that first of all, we were what? That's the kind of friends you keep? Like, do you believe in that same thing? It was a little girl's birthday. Do you believe in that too? Fucking Mexicans. Evelyn, come on. Do you, no, do you believe in that? Who, which one of you lives here? My, which my, one, hold on. Which one of you guys live here? We have their picture. We're going to submit it. It's fine. Right, just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Uh, racist comment that my children heard. It's, you know what? It's expected. Let's go. Yeah, you're, y'all getting recorded. So our next crazy Karen pulled up to the store and gave these people a really hard time over a discount. Let's check it out. And under it is this, or the sign, okay? Then you have to sell it for that price. Do you know that one time I went, I walked into the store and there was a bit. Oh my God, if you have them alone. Oh, shut up. No. no you need to leave our store now. You're being rude to our other customers. She's coming over here telling us. You're being rude to our other customers yeah. who are being placed She is shop. entering in and it's not her business. Well, maybe it feels so loud. It was my business. business. He is breaking the law here. Then go complain somewhere else and leave this court yeah, down. Let's call the cops then. Oh, yeah. Oh, really? Well, you need to leave now or I'm going to call the cops. Go right ahead. My okay, husband is fine. I'm trying to stand up for somebody that you are berating. So there's no reason to. You're upset. We can enter by the box and there. There's 60% off and he will not. Okay, and you got a problem, you get the f out of here. Who's close for you? You on camera too, miss. Yeah, In good. You're on camera okay. too. And you've been on okay, camera. Just... You guys have to leave. Okay, we're gonna leave. Okay, you just try to like come really close to me because you think yeah. you're scaring us. Leave now. Okay. Or what? Yeah. Or what? Or this. Would you like to leave? What is that? Did he? Would you like to see what it is? Sir, you're on recording. Leave us. Leave. Leave the premises. Sir, I'm gonna call the police on you right now. Don't call them. Uh, so our next crazy Karen is getting into a very heated confrontation at this gas station. Let's check it out. Hey! Hey! Knock it the f off! Knock it the f off! Get out of here! 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 Get out of
Get him back to your goddamn car! Oh, no! Crazy Karens get kicked off of this train for causing havoc. Let's check it out. Karens get kicked off a train from Chicago to St. Louis. Problems at this party and got exactly what she deserved. Let's check it out. Hey, hi. Get off. Get off the boat. No, you both got to get off the boat. That's all right. Yes, you do. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Tell them what you did. I know and nobody assaulted anybody. No, 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 nobody assaulted you. You sold us, you sold us a stolen PlayStation 5. That's what you did. You sold us a stolen PlayStation 5, okay? And we asked for our money back. Uh so this next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown at Walmart. Let's jump right into it. So our next crazy Karen goes toe to toe with the president of the HOA over a plumbing disagreement. And you already know when you mix the two together, some shit is definitely about to go down. So let's check out the full video and see what happens next. Tell these people why you need to be booted out. I'm gonna show them all the legal records. I'm gonna show them how poorly you are as the president. Good. Now, if you do not let me get that water turned off in 24 hours, I am going to court as an emergency shut off against you, and I am going to personally take out some very, very serious violations against you. And I already know the board, and I already know you cannot afford that. Now, I am saying to you one more time, yes or no, are you going to put, give them a 24-hour notice? I have already gone to Catherine's boss, and they are already checking you out in violation. I own that unit. Do you see my face? I have already said to you multiple times, 
You're a bully. Yes, of course. You're a bully. Of course. I you have are. all. Talk to you. Please step out of I'm my asking way. you now so I can have it on there. Are you going to give them a 24 of hour course. notice? Of the course. The rule is 48 hours. You then 48 run. hours okay. from right now. I already have it scheduled okay. for them to come at 12 o'clock right. on Friday. You need to let these people know that the plumber of your choice. I already called the people that you had come yeah. before. They are coming here. That's the one you approved right. for I before. Do. They are coming here and they are going to do the plumbing. Okay. If they do not, I am telling you that little $9,000 something you got in backup from your homeowners. I'm going to tell you right now, you're going to be in the hole. It's already been wiped up. You know you. what? But if Please it's been wiped up, the then it's what you did to them. You did that to these people. You cost them money because no, you're a bully. Please. All you want to do is win. You want to win? It's personal. This isn't personal. These people live here. Okay. They Look. pay money to live here. It's sure not is. about you and what you want to do to bully people. You cannot bully me. I am I'm telling you right you. now. I'll I, have an attorney till the cows answer. come home. I'll pay and pay and pay. I'd mortgage my house if I have to to go up beside of you. You will never win. I will never let Please a bully step like out you. Of my way. I will step out of your way. I'm asking you right now. I said it already. Yes. Say it out loud. Yes, you're having someone come here because I'm having the plumber come on Friday at 12 o'clock. Is that accurate? Yes or no? Is yes. It's fine. Please. Don't ever block in. You can be heard over the other side of the group from the block away. You can ask us now. Right. You can ask us now. We are trying. I'm sorry, I've let you off. I can't come into town now without being equipped with noise pollution. Yes. Oh, can you see that? Yes. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, so our next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown at this grocery store all because she was refused service for not wearing a mask. Let's check it out. Ah. Uh, so our next crazy Karen gets into a heated confrontation with employees at this store. Let's jump right into it. And you don't get a gift box. Leave the store. She already told you. 
There's not a gate box for that. Leave. Leave. I'm going to call security on you. Call them. Call them. Who are you? I don't care. Who is she? <coughs> she, she's a customer. She's a customer. You're a customer. The same as you. You're a customer. The same as you. you, know, you don't don't leave customer. the store. If you don't like because there's not a gift box, leave the store. Leave her alone. You are a customer. I don't care. You're disrespecting yeah. her and you're making her feel bad. I'm not making her. What did you want? Somebody call Listen. Store. No, I'm just recording. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Call them. I'm the manager. Okay. She's disrespecting the lady. Am I right? Yes. Right? Yes. Leave the store. I'm not leaving the store. Well, call 911 or call the police. I'm trying to purchase. I'm trying to purchase. I think we should all call them. What already told you? You are not the police. I don't care who I am. You're disrespecting this lady. You need to leave. I don't need to do shit. Call security, please. Call security. Yeah. Call security. We are closing. Okay, call security. 40 minutes. Okay. Get this woman they, out of my face. They want to go home and spend time with the family. She's interfering with my, my purchase. Sir, I'm, 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 I'm just gonna, talking to you. you she's interfering yeah, she's with right. my purchase. I just got yeah. a purchase from you earlier and they don't give you She is interfering with my purchase. Am I right, guys? Right. He's yeah. being disrespectful. He needs to leave. If, hey, I'm I don't sorry. speak Arabic. I don't care if you speak. I understand. They were speaking Arabic. I don't speak Arabic. Is this a program, some kind of show, TV show going on right now? Because I can't believe that you're going to you, sit sir. here and talk to somebody because you don't understand them? No, I don't speak Arabic. I need to be they were speaking Arabic. I don't I speak Arabic. So they're talking to each other, right? Were they talking to you? Yes. Well, sort of. But you don't speak Arabic, so how do you know they were talking about you? I have no idea. That's okay, why. so that's why Wait a minute, they're who are saying you again? I don't care who you think I am, but what I am is a no, person. Are you a policeman? Don't worry about who I am. Are you who I am will here? come out. You work here? Who I am will come out. Work here. <laughs> okay, so now I'm maybe you're going to. Purchase to a purse. All right, are you are you going to purchase? Yeah, are you going to let I'm, him I'm purchase? I'm trying to make the, this uh, purchase. And you're okay, so what's the issue? It's fine. We we're just gonna go there and you can. Check I want to make this purchase. Yes, and you're and being we all mean. Are. You're being mean to her. Be uh, a bunch of Democrats. <laughs> Yeah, a bunch of Democrats. Like, bunch of Democrats. Yeah. I don't so what? Democrat, if you're white, black, if you speak no, no, English, Spanish, I don't hey, care. Hey, I'm in America. Just I want to speak English. That's it. That's all I asked. That's all I'm asking. Okay. All I asked was for her to speak English. Be a gentleman. All I asked for her to do is speak English. Sir, we're gonna put like a box for you like that, and you can put it in a box. Better better okay. Be good. And get these customers away. Ladies, he doesn't have one dollar to buy a gift box. That's why we're complaining. That's really? Like that's it? To the manager. Oh, okay, man. That's for real. For real. For real. Oh, my God. Is that what the issue is? No, it isn't. It's not? Sir. No. Okay. <laughs> okay. I, I think uh, we're all the Arabs, all you Arabs and Democrats. <laughs> but you really? go back where you sir. came from. Sir, really? Can you, can you, can well, you she's go. making a big stand. Can Why don't I? Sir, okay. Can you please go in fragrances department? She's checking on the manager. What is happening? Okay, good. Is this real life? She's hey, there. She's I in fragrances department. I, I cannot see how many Arabs Let came out of the you. woodwork. Dude, you're the snowflake here. Fuck you. See what up the Put me on YouTube. Sir. Say what up. Sir. Snowflake your ass. Yep. Stupid Democrat. Yep. Say what up. Uh, so this next guy waits for his test results for the bar exam with his mother. Let's check it out.
behind him. This guy noticed the cat in danger of flooding during Hurricane Ian in Florida, so he went out to rescue it. The cat allowed him to help, and he was able to pick it up and walk it into his home for safety. An incredible moment of this man going out of his way to save an animal. Baby! <laughs> No le agarra. No, let her. No, come on. Let's do it real quick. Go get your mans, Michelle. No, look at that. No, look at that. That's enough. Got plenty of that shit. Come no. on. No. Doing necklaces and bracelets and all that. Let me go right there. Hmm. Right. Look at her body's Yo, forming. Love. love. She's saying something. Love. L O V E. Oh, oh show. Make sure to like and subscribe. Until next time, guys. More Karens. Stop calling people Karen. Grow up. Call them a cunt. Like an adult.